Father, what is the meaning of this? Swing at that rock. I'm sorry? Go on. Slice the rock. No, no. That won't do. Again. Another. Father, please explain yourself. Try hitting me. Are you mad, Father? Don't hesitate. Swing at me. <sighs> I should have trained you when you were younger. What? What is this about, Father? Is this about the Covenant? How much do you really know of them, Zane? I know plenty. While growing up, we were told that the early years Sanghili made a pact with the Shang Shayun, which formed the Covenant Armada. Later, they recruited the Ungui, King Ya, and humans? When the- No. I asked how much do you really know of them. Not their history. What- what am I missing? The Covenant is made up of several species, led by hypocritical, self-proclaimed seers. The Sangili, no. Elites who take part and align themselves with the Covenant are nothing but bodyguards, puppets, for the prophets to use. The humans figured this out early enough, and managed to separate their kind from the rest. Some of the species tried to follow, but not all managed to leave. I was once a Covenant Lance, but obey every will of the prophets. No matter how tedious or unhonorable it seemed, it was my duty, my job, my title as the Arbiter, and I wore it proudly. I thought the title of Arbiter was sacred to San Helios. It still is, but at one point, when the Prophets came to strike a deal, it caused an uproar and Sengili turned against Sengili. The Arbiter, known on our lands to stand for honor and compassion while also harboring the lives of others, was stripped from us, armor and all. Was the Arbiter deemed a heretic amongst the Council? We learned that there was a special suit of armor bestowed upon Sanghili, who hindered progress of the Great Journey. But none of the Sanghili allied with the Covenant currently wears it. The Arbiter was, yes. Whatever happened to the Arbiter, how can the title still be sacred to our homeland and yet the armor is with the Covenant? Was with the Covenant, but no longer. I don't understand. What are you not telling me, Father? Zane, my son, I am still the Arbiter. I endured far too much while under the tyranny of the Prophets, so I tossed away the armor that deemed us heretics and returned the title home where it belonged. That sword you wield is the last thing connecting me and my past. It saved me on countless occasions, and although I pray to the gods that you never have to use it, I give it to you so that I may protect you as well. Are the Covenant coming after you? Zane, I fear that they're coming after more than just I. Then let's fight. I'm sorry? We can gather everyone in the village, everyone under the mountain clan, and fight back, Father. May... maybe the other clans might... might join us. Yes, maybe they might if we take our stand first. Enough, Zane. But Father, we can show them- I said enough! There is no fighting the Covenant. My only job as chief of our village is to make sure I keep my people safe. I shall not gamble the lives of my brothers and sisters on a maybe. I will not risk losing you and your mother. Then why? Why give me the sword? Train with it. Learn how to defend yourself and use it only if necessary. Your posture could use some work, but you're fast. Keep at it. You might be able to understand the way of the sword, just as I. Is the way of the sword special or something? <laughs> How do you think I managed to leave the Covenant unscathed? Come now. Before the sun sets, use the sword to catch some fish. Easier said than done. Trust me. I would know.
That was the last who rebelled. The rest are coming willingly. Excellent. Call in the transport to bring the new recruits aboard the ship. And what of you, master? I'll have the lances scavenge what they can find in this dump. Bravi better be grateful when I return. General Ra, there's someone on the mountain. Oh no. Capture him. Stop. Father, look. What should we do? We can't just watch and do nothing. Staying idle is the last thing I'll ever do. Keep the sword on the skiff. What do we need to fight? It won't come to that. And how can you be so sure? Don't you have faith in your father? Of course. And please, do as I say. The sword in their presence will only show how fearful they truly are. I am truly sorry, Your Excellency. Oh, huh. this is one mistakes you for a zealot. Quiet before I silence you myself. Come with us. The general wants to exchange words with you. I saw nothing. I promise I was just passing by. It wasn't a request. You will come with us. To what lengths will the Almighty Covenant go in order to deem Singili no more than just a forgotten species? You've even modified our skeeves. What is the meaning of this? I don't answer to you. Now run along with your boy and stay out of our way. Do you lack honor? Honey down a child as this you were a key from. My honor is firm! Then what is the cause behind such dishonorable acts? We should just kill them. General Ra will be displeased if we don't bring the boy. The name is not familiar, but I assume he's your shipmaster. Huh, shipmaster. Quiet, all of you. We have orders, and it will be dishonorable not to follow. What is your general run with the boy? Ugh, I've had enough. I want you all to return to the village at once. But, General, we have yet to capture. I said at once, Major! Yes, General. <sighs>
Return to the village, Jiro Ra is waiting. Are you okay? I believe so. Thank you for saving me. I did no such thing. I tried to prevent the inevitable. Lucky for us, they were slipping back. You are Chief of Horses, child. Ara, was it? Yes, father. Did you persuade them to leave? Not quite. But they're gone for the time being. We should return to the village as well. I'm sure your mother is worried. Come with us. The sun is almost set. You can return to your mother and father in the morning. If I won't be a burden. Nonsense. My name is Zayn Vola, son of Chief Anubis of the Valley Village. I am Aura Telkin, son of Chief Orsis of the Mountain Clan. Then I must be in front of royalty. Forgive me, I did no not- No need to bow, please. Very well. But you are next in line to- Make haste, Zayn and Aura. Coming, father. You think mother will be fine with this? She's my better half. There's no doubt that she will. 